what do you think is more important to have this stay within plane or stay within you know what I mean this you is that more important or is it more important to have the plane of this it depends on your club face so at the top of the swing you got okay. three different things right for the and the face is straight up that's closed and then in between is neutral which is you know standard right okay what they say is perfect right so if I keep the club more close which like say like a, like a Zach Johnson or um, a Dustin Johnson okay um, several are they guys, related are they brothers no okay um, they both keep it more closed now Dustin does it you know does the little wrist thing uh -huh. right? but that still keeps it close right and so when he comes through he has to kind of hold it off which is why his swing kind of looks the way it does because oh. if he actually rotated he'd snap hook everything right because he's already closed up correct. on top correct so if you're closed on top you have to actually hold off that clip face from turning over to keep it closed through which is why he gotcha has finish, why he finishes kind of like this right because you have to keep it there right if he did any type of rotation it would hook if he was over here it would hook then you got like a for instance like a hogan it's more like single you know here and his club face was more here, more neutral to open, if anything. Explain again, what is closed? I, I open it is up, I, uh, right. apparently, right. right? Well, no, closed. So that it's pointing straight up, Correct. is what it's I flat. see. You, like if you can hold a bucket, you can put a, a bottle, if you can put a cup on it. Oh, okay. Right, so this, okay. the, the, the face of the club facing up is closed. Okay. Right, and then, so if this is closed. Okay, okay closed. That's gonna be more neutral, which is kind of at an angle. Okay, so toe down. Well, it'd be down would be open. Down would oh, be okay. Open. This is so closed. neutral. Neutral's is in the middle. Like here, then. Yeah, neutral would be here. And what it would do is it would match the match your where your arm is. Does that make sense? Yeah. Okay. Your wrist. It matches this. Correct. Matches this. Correct. So if I'm here, right, it's all matched up. If I look from this way, the shaft, my arm. Everything's in a line. I'm not outside of it. I'm not flat. You know what's crazy is that, did you hold that position? Go ahead, do it again. This kind of would match this angle here. I wonder if there's a correlation between them. You know what we talking about the setup angle? Yeah, the, yeah, yeah this yeah. would go straight A single straight plane line. means I'm gonna set up here and I'm also gonna- Oh, oh, oh single plane is neutral then. Yeah. Oh, uh, I, sorry. So, I, I didn't but it, it, so, so what I'm saying is, I know I can't, it's not a definitive answer because it, there's just no such thing. Because if I go if I go uh, closed, right, okay. and I go here, it's so shut that when I rotate around, look what it does. Gotcha. It hooks it, right? Okay. Vice versa, if I go open, right? Open club face? If I go, yeah, if I go open and upright, I'm okay. gonna come down, it's gonna be here. It's gonna be open. Okay. So if you go upright with an open club face, you're gonna have to like. So if you just go right in the middle, neutral, neutral, right? So everything's your grip is neutral, everything's set up neutral, and you go right over the right shoulder. Okay. So right over the right shoulder. And that's face, neutral. That's you know all normal, you know, it's gonna the cliff face, the, the shaft, everything will match, you know, yeah. what you're doing here. And, and what you mean normal is that's the conventional way of conventional, pros teaching. Conventional, yes. 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 Okay. Now that's that doesn't fit everybody. Right. Right? You gotta do whatever fits you. People with longer arms or shorter arms or strong hands or weak hands or whatever one leg shorter than the other yeah so and then of course you know no no pros are to, are alike right so when you say yeah. well i see most pros well who's most pros speed doesn't do that mcelroy doesn't do that he doesn't do the single Bubba plane doesn't do they all have their own thing none of them are just like this or just like this but is speed single plane speed well no speed forget about plane for a second okay just as far as as far as what they do at the top of the swing he has a bent left elbow right he has a weaker grip Okay. It, it doesn't match like what the normal would be. I mean, I'm just saying that's why it's not a strict answer because you do what fits you. Okay. Because Spieth has had this swing since he was like 10 years old. It's just what developed, right? Okay. He didn't change. Look, he didn't change much. I saw his swing when um, when he was 12 when he first when the I instructor did too. that he has yeah. now same looking swing. Yeah. The instructor just kind of little things, right? Club face, angle, ball position, right? Body movement, but his swing looks pretty much identical. So, yeah. So he, that's just what he had. Same with Dustin. Same with Bubba. All these guys, like Bubba's way up here right but he makes this move down here to square it up i mean yeah you do you do what you can do understanding how are you going to get the club face to be square at the bottom that's, that's yeah the only thing that when matters. you strike it correct however you can get it there the easy the most consistent way you can get it there is the way 
you want to do it. So right. what do you think is more important? Do you mm -hmm. think it's more important to have the single plane or do you think it's more important to have this plane? Is it, in other words, as if there was, maybe because the sun's gonna block right there. Is it more important to hold a straight line here? Okay, it would be if you have a strong grip. What's a strong grip? A strong grip is a closed cliff face. If you have a closed cliff face, it's gonna be- And that means, hold on, let me see grip. your hands. Go down to the bottom. Oh, well, I just did a strong grip. Right, 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 right. You can have a close club face with a weak grip. It doesn't uh, matter. Weak, gri weak grip would be neutral here. Strong grip would be your weak, thumb pushing pressure weak down. Weak grip on would be 11 o'clock. Clock face. Wow, that's a really weak grip. Weak grip, neutral. Neutral strong, and strong. Like, really strong, right? Okay. So, so if I go, if I keep the club face facing the target, right? Okay. I need to bring, the club has to come up here. Gotcha. Or else it would, or else I'll hook it. You can't have... You can't be down here with a close clip face. Right. It just doesn't work. Okay. You have to make all. Then you have to like make this all these movements just to try to square it up. Right. Vice versa, when the grip's over here, right? You don't want to necessarily be way up top, because then you have to make a big movement just to square it up. Okay. So, so what I'm, the, way, the way the way I'm answering your question is, it's, it depends on your grip. You don't judge okay. your backswing first. First, it's your grip. You get your, your grip set up. If you have a neutral grip, right, right down the middle. Okay. Then you can have. A neutral backswing, which is you know right which over the right shoulder. Which is single plane. Correct. Okay. If you go new, like standard neutral, 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 and that, and it fits what your body wants to do. Yeah. Great. Then you can st stick everything there. If you like a stronger grip, yeah. Then you got to be kind of a little bit more upright. Upright. And if you like a weaker grip, then you got to be a little bit more around. Okay. That's just it's just. Okay. How, how we get the the club to square up the the most efficient way. Yeah. So what I, I mean, what I do is, I, you know, I will go up there and I will, I will weaken my grip and hit some shots and see what happens with a weak grip. And then, you know, how does it feel? And then I'll go to a strong grip, you know, see how it feels like you have to figure out what feels the best, what your body is capable of doing. Now with a strong grip, mm -hmm. or I'm sorry, with a closed club face, mm -hmm. you're going to have to have more body movement mm -hmm. because it keeps the club face square. Okay, so less rotation. Body movement. Less club head rotation, more body More rotation. like a pop, like a... Correct. So that's why boom. Dustin, you're going to see him like this. Right. Because he has to. It looks like he's holding it off. Because he is. Okay. So, because he has to. If he rotated with, with the way he swings, boom. So you're saying that Dustin Johnson doesn't um, release? Or he only releases when he has to hit like a he draw? Or... Without, he re when he releases, he releases the angle... He doesn't turn the club face. Gotcha. Because his toe is not going to do that. Okay. He's going to stay square. Boom. And then release up there. Yeah. And then so it's a little bit later. Gone, that's just, you know. So he's he's here. He's keeping the club face, you know, because square. of his wrist, right? Right. that wrist thing. So he's like this. Okay. Right? Boom. And then his body has to be here. Now somebody who is more up here is going to have to have more arm hand arm movement to square the club face. Gotcha. Because if they're... If they're if their grip is weak and they get here, see what it does? Yeah. It keeps it wide open and they really have to kind of, so they have to actually have their hands do more rotation, not as much as their body, which is a lot, you see a lot of the older guys yeah. that can't get their body moving, they, they're more, they're more hands. Oh. It'll be more of a weaker grip for the most part. I mean, yeah. there's no guarantee, right? Everybody has their own unique Yeah, 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 yeah. In essence, to, again, to answer your question, is it's gonna based on how you're set up Okay. How your grip is was going to determine a better way of where you are up here. Okay. So if you're more neutral, right? Mm -hmm. Then boom, then you can just go right over the shoulder, right on plane. Yeah. Over the left shoulder, right on plane. Yeah. You depends on your right grip then. To left it it does. 100% depends on your grip. Because, yeah, let's okay. let's let's go through the three and I want to see your so hand is, position this, up on top. This is a strong grip. Strong grip was means thumb is applying pressure. That thumb is applying pressure to, well, right? Well, Do you see what I'm saying? Well, it's just because the back of my the back of my left hand. So like uh, this is what happens when you when your hands over here. If I relax, it it's closes closed, it. Okay. Right, because watch what is your what does our hands do? Right. If they go back to whatever our normal. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Your neutral is wherever your hands hang naturally. That's your neutral. That gotcha. makes sense. Yeah. Guys that are like this, like gorillas, okay. they're gonna they're they're actually naturally gonna have a strong grip because that's where the cliff face is square. Okay. Does that make sense? Yeah, yeah. So yeah. if I actually so if I go if my hands hang like this, right? Okay. And I grip it at that angle. Okay. Okay. And I relax. 
Okay. It's dead straight. Yeah. Even though it looks a little strong. Yeah. But that's my neutral. Okay. So that's where my hands are going to come back to because of my because of my forearm development, because of my shoulder development. Yeah. That's what angle gives that. You don't have what I have. I don't have what you have. Yeah. Your your neutral is different than my neutral, right? Yeah. So you kind of see the angle, right? Okay. Naturally. Okay. And you kind of try to match that angle with the club. Okay. And that's where the club's going to want to come back dead straight. Okay. Go ahead and go through the the three then. So, Let's. Sorry, okay. I took you off okay. course there. So this would be strong. Okay. For me, my strong. Yeah. Because it closes the club face. Okay. Right. So what happens with that is when I take my backswing. Okay. And hold it. It keeps it shut. Okay. So that's straight up. Yep. Okay. Okay. And your hand. Okay. And then if I go neutral, and I'm taking the same backswing, right? Same, yeah. Same angle. Just which is pretty much 12 o'clock. Right. Okay. So and the go, thumb is up on top. It's like, okay. Yeah, the left thumb. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then I go here, and then I do the same swing. Okay, so that... So that would be neutral. The plane would match the... Club the, face. the club fit and the Correct. rod here. Correct. Okay. Plane matches the club face. Okay. Right? And then I go weak. It's and that's like 11 o'clock. Thumb to the... Thumb at 11 o'clock. Yeah, okay. 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 And then I take the same swing. And then it's going to be facing down. Facing down, yeah. Toe down. Okay. I just swung on the same exact plane as far as where my hands are. Yeah. Right? Hands yeah. Hands to shoulder, right? Yeah. But that's three different grips. Yeah. So the, the club face matches the swing plane. Okay. The club face has to match the, match the swing plane, which means your grip has to match the swing plane. Or else you're going to be constantly having to make some sort of an adjustment during your swing. All you got to do is match, is just match up that hand, right, with that club face. That club face just has to stay down the line like we've always talked about. Yeah. As soon as you start getting more into that rotation, you're taking away a little more, you have less time to square the club face. I'm not saying it's not possible because a lot of pros hit draws too. I'm just saying in general, the way that the hands match up with the swing plane, I, f I feel like the fade and a lot of, you know, history of golf feel like the fade is a better consistent shot. I agree. But again, we just you just gotta match up what your club face is doing with your swing plane. 